Hey, how's it going? It's Matt, uh, also known as Wildy Scrub. Um, you may be aware today was supposed to be the first episode of Bioshock 2, and this is very much not Bioshock 2. Uh, the reasoning for that is I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to express some of my thoughts and my feelings, but it'll be a little bit rambly. Um, I'm not gonna edit this video, I'm not gonna try to cut or make myself sound better, I just want this to be kind of a raw emotion vent feed, I don't know. Um, but I was, I was sitting here and I was editing the video. It's, it's Tuesday night right now. And I was sitting and editing the video and I just, I just felt kind of gross editing it. And, you know, not that video games don't have their own merit and not that even shooting or shooter games are, are bad or anything. But right now at this time in America, if you're watching this in the future, for some reason, this is, uh, at the peak of the George Floyd, um, frankly murder protests and and rioting and all that stuff and i and i was i was just feeling a lot of things and i started editing it and i got about a minute into the episode and i just said i i, I just can't i just can't put this out tomorrow um today is tuesday there are a bunch of things going all over social media with this blackout tuesday thing and there's just been a lot going on in the world and i feel like it's not right to put out a video right now of me playing a shooter game kind of lightheartedly and, and joking and having fun with it when there is actual violence and actual tragedy and, and things happening in the world. And I, I, it was specifically America, not the world. It's America. It's an American problem. Um, I'm not one to really politicize on my Twitch or my YouTube. Um, but I've just, this, this week has just been really hard for everyone um but especially for people directly affected by the issues at hand um i've been just hurting and just struggling to know how even to approach life these past few days and i mean selfishly and i i will admit it selfishly because i can afford to do this i've i've kind of reclused i've kind of hidden away i skipped work i have stayed home i mean i've just been trying to avoid feeling all the things that I feel about race relations and, and my discomfort with some of the things going on. And ultimately, I, I just... I, I made a post today, and I didn't feel... Like, normally when I make, like, a big post on social media, I feel kind of done. Like, I've said my piece, and I feel a little bit more closure, but I just haven't felt closure, and I think part of that is because this isn't an issue that's solved by social media posts, but also... I was just continuing life like it was normal, and right now life isn't normal, and that's not good. Um, I, I don't know if this makes any sense at all. I don't know if anything I'm saying makes any sense, but the, the, the point that I want to make is is the world is a hard place, and right now a lot of people are hurting. Um, it's, it's heartbreaking to see a man murdered with, from a knee on his neck for, you know, not almost nine minutes. It hurts to see peaceful protesters attacked and have masks torn off and sprayed with tear gas. And it hurts to see private businesses and little family mom and pop shops destroyed and their whole life's work thrown away by riots. And it hurts to see just all the hatred and the anger that's going on right now. And there is a lot of hatred and anger and just frankly, disgusting, depraved humanity at its raw, rawest self. Um, there's just a lot of violence and hatred and anger and things going on in the world that I just, it just felt wrong to keep going like everything was normal. And it's not like I'm that big of a target. It's not like I'm that big of a, of a, of a YouTuber. I mean, I have like two or three consistent viewers, um, I'm not doing this for attention. I'm not, I thought about sharing this on my social media, but I just, I just don't even want to. I just want you guys to know, those of you that do watch my videos, I want you to know that I do not, I, I just, I just don't like what's going on. And I, and I have made efforts, you know, I, I have made donations and I, I will link some places you can donate if you need, if you have the resources to, and you, you feel like you should. Um, I'm going to link some places you can donate in the, in the description and, um, I don't know. I just, I, I don't want this to go too long, but the, 
the most important thing that I want people to know is that I, I, I was very much an all lives matter kind of guy for a while. I was very much like, just because at my core, I just want everyone to be respected and loved and treated the same. I'm a person who really does not like being disliked. And I really, really don't like seeing other people dislike others. And just, I, I hate when people, I, the irony of this statement, I hate when people throw around the word hate willy nilly, like, oh, I hate her. Oh, she's awful. Oh, he's a terrible person. You know, like I just, it just makes me sad to see negativity spread. And right now it feels like that's all there is, is a lot of negativity. And I want to make it known that I stand for everything that's being protested. I stand with Black America, um, which I wouldn't have said, you know, a year and a half ago, two years ago. I probably wouldn't have said Black Lives Matter, but I am, I'm on board. You got me. You finally got me. Um, because it's not an all lives issue right now. It's a Black Lives issue. Um, George Floyd is not... Uh, this was not an isolated case of a man being murdered. It was a black man being murdered by a white cop. And, uh, you know, obviously not all cops are like that. And not every case is like this. But right now, people are hurting. And the least that I can do is suspend my kind of happy-go-lucky normal schedule, I guess. Um, basically what I'm trying to say is this, I'm not going to be posting videos the rest of the week. Um, I had only one Bioshock episode recorded. I was going to record another one tonight and try to talk about all this in the video. And I thought there's just kind of a sad irony to playing a shooting game while talking about white on black violence. Like that's just, that's just not right, you know? And it just feels wrong to try to put something out tomorrow that just ignores everything going on. So this video, tomorrow being today, the day you're watching this. So this, this video is the only one I'm going to release for the rest of the week. Um, Monday, the regular schedule will start back up, but at least for the remainder of this week, um, maybe Monday, might be Wednesday. I don't know. I might give it a week. I don't know. We'll see where things are at in America over the weekend, but just, it felt wrong when I'm hurting and when people, I mean, people way more affected than this by this than me are, are hurting even more. I mean, even saying that I'm hurting feels selfish, but it's true. I think we all are hurting. And I think, well, I don't even know what I'm trying to say. The point is this videos are not going up. Um, if you really love my entertainment, go watch a black creator or support, you know, go spend that time looking into some of the issues at hand, but go spend that time donating, supporting, sharing love. I think the biggest thing that I want to get across that I haven't really been talking about is no matter what you do, no matter what side of the spectrum you're on, no matter what belief you have, whatever social, political stances you have, the most important thing to do right now is spread love. Spread love. Do not spread hate. Do not spread... Uh, just... just don't be part of the problem, you know? We need to all love each other a little bit more. And I've grown up in a very non-black lifestyle. I, I live in Utah. The black population is one of the lowest in the entire nation in Utah, right? It's hard for me to even know what black people go through. Um, and so I think the most important thing we can do right now is just spread a little bit of love, you know? No matter how you feel about everything going on, Spread love, spread kindness, do a good thing for someone else, pay it forward, whatever it is. You know, if you have the resources to donate, donate. Um, if you watch me on Twitch and you're subscribing to me and you don't feel like you have the money to donate for a cause, don't subscribe to me. I mean, take a month off, take two months off. I don't really care. I care that the, pe the people that are affected are being helped. Um, so that's my ramble. I don't, I don't know if it got across at all anything that I wanted it to, but it's how I feel and it's what's going on and I'm putting videos on a hiatus. Um, check the description for places you can go to donate and help and sorry, I did a thing that ended up being self-promotion and I felt awful about that. But thank you guys for the community. I mean, I know a lot of people on my YouTube or from my Twitch. And I am grateful for you guys. And I'm grateful for the loving community we have, for the support that we show each other, for just the kindness that I find 
through everything. Um, keep spreading it. Keep sharing the love. Black Lives Matter. And, and go do something good. Thanks.